Todd scoops me and Becky Word Girl Botsford scour the big city searching for stories in the grocery store. Hey, I could go for a sandwich. You? Uh, do you mean like a sandwich sandwich? Like a sandwich just like a sandwich, you know? I mean, I know what a sandwich sandwich means, but... Uh, what? You know, I'm, I'm actually, I'm not hungry at all. Oh, okay. Well, that about does it. Great! What is it? The best sandwich press the world has ever seen, and I invented it. Watch! <laughs> Must have been a faulty sandwich. That baby could crush a car. Seems a bit extreme for a sandwich press, though. I don't think it's extreme at all. I think it's more... Wait, what's the word? I, oh, I know it. Um, Loud? Obnoxious? Totally destructive? Kind of, but I was thinking of something more positive. Just get it out of here. But you need this machine. No, I'm pretty sure I don't. Well, maybe this will convince you. How's this for extreme? Hi, can I help you? I think I'll have your number four. Okay, let me just press that for you. No, thanks. Really? It's no bother? No. It'll take five seconds. I don't want it pressed. Hi. Hi, what would you like? Did you tie that man up and put him on that, um... Sandwich press? That seems a bit extreme. My machine is not extreme. What? I said I didn't want it pressed. Well, extreme means going beyond the usual limits, and looking at this sandwich, I would say that extreme seems to be the right word. Sorry, I'm hungry. See? That was an extreme hunger pang. You think just because you're word girl you have the right word for everything? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah? Well, my name is Chuck, uh, the evil sandwich-making guy, and I'm gonna make a sandwich out of him. <laughs> Can word girl stop Chuck, the evil sandwich-making guy, from turning the store manager into a squashed sandwich? Should Chuck, the evil sandwich-making guy, have chosen a less extreme name? How many times can I say Chuck, the evil sandwich-making guy without getting sick of saying Chuck, the evil sandwich-making guy? Find out next time on another installment of Word